It's very important for me to look and feel good um, in my job as being an estate agent. Um, I go into people's houses and if I don't feel that I look good, then I don't feel as confident as I could do. I go into a lot of people's properties and they're obviously looking at your face and um, if your hair's not looking good and your makeup's not right, then um, I don't feel as confident as I could do. I've always noticed people's uh, women's hair that thins and I especially noticed my mother's hair when I was younger and I always wanted to pull it around so you didn't see the bald patch and um, a few years ago I was walking along the road with my daughter and horror upon horrors I felt the hand at the back of my head and my daughter was pulling my hair around so that's when I first noticed it. It could be I'm have always been on a diet for as long as I can remember and I have done a lot of crash diets so it could well be um, that's the fact why you know why my hair's got thinner. When I realised I had thinning hair it actually made me feel old although it's not really an old person's complaint you can get that at any time but yeah that's what it made me feel like. It definitely um, affected how attractive I felt because I knew I wasn't looking my best and I knew that I could look better. My husband noticed that uh, my hair was getting thin and he's actually a hairdresser. It kind of affected my marriage because when we were due to go out, I'm always upstairs trying to sort my hair out and cover it up. And then if I came down, my husband would say, oh, let me do this bit of your hair. Um, I'll cover your ball patch up. Yeah, that really annoyed me. <laughs> I don't think it's any easier to cope with uh, thinning hair as you get older. Um, it must be devastating when you're young to have it, um, but I think at any age it's a problem. I felt um, quite alone suffering from thinning hair because um, there wasn't any one person that I could actually relate to that I felt was in the same situation as me. I tried to hide the hair loss um, with lots of hairspray, backcombing, um, but it really wasn't all that successful. I also bought a wig that I wore on occasions, but it wasn't something that I wanted to do every day. I think uh, the media makes it worse for people with uh, women with hair loss. All of the um, hair adverts have got women with long, flowing, thick hair and it definitely makes you feel worse because you know where in a million years you're going to have hair like that. <laughs> I got help in the end um, for my hair. I was looking on a TV show and I saw Jenny Bond and um, she was, had the same problem and she mentioned a food supplement. So I subsequently got onto their website and found out that yes, it is a very good idea to take, a food supp uh, to take supplements for your hair.